Tell a friend to tell a friend that do what all haul is in. And we're back with another NBA 2K23 next gen build video. And today I have a special Stephen Curry build for you guys. Steph Curry, Chef Curry, whatever the hell you want to call him. But this build right here is a two way play shot. And I know y'all probably thinking, like, Steph Curry ain't no two way. Well, guess what? I did want to playmaker shot creator name. I didn't want the inside out playmaker name. I didn't want sharpshoot. I didn't want shoot. I didn't want none of that. I wanted the two way play shot for Steph Curry. So. This bill will be able to shoot lights out. You already know that. And the playmaking is super, super crazy. And you already know I gave the bill some defense. That's how we get the name two-way. A lot of times I see too many people making these small bills with no defense. You don't have to give up the defense just to get a good bill. So make sure you watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. We are going to point guard position with the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. And as you guys can see, 6'2", 193 on the weight. 6'7 wingspan, built body shape. Let's get into the build. We're going to start with the finishing. Now, if you are one of those people that don't watch basketball and, you know, you want a build like Steph Curry, you know Steph Curry don't be doing no dunking. You know, you probably didn't see him dunk all year. You may see him dunking in the warm-up. I ain't saying he can't dunk, but the man don't be dunking in the game. You know what I'm saying? But I understand that you have to separate the two real life versus the game. I understand that. But uh, with this build, we didn't add any driving dunk. We went to the layup, we took that layup to an 84, and that gave us um, gold acrobat, which is pretty good, you know. Uh, we also have a close shot of a 76, which will get us silver fast twitch, all right. Slithery is a good bad that I would like to have, but you need uh, 16 to get there, so I would say add three uh, bash points to this right here, man, so we can get 16, and we can come over here and get that slithery on this build because I think that will help you out a lot at the rim. We'll use fast twist, we'll use acrobat and fearless, okay? So that'll be 5, 9, 13, 19, and giant slayer. So let's say 21. So you'll need about eight more badges, right? So if we add, if we add three, that will give us 16. Uh we'll need to add about, let's say, let's say about three badges. So let's say, let's say we add three, three extra badges or whatever. And um, not three, but three will give us 16. We'll need about 18. So let's add five extra badges to this right here so we can get everything that we just called out. Okay, I think that's about it. So let's see, 6, 10, 15, 19, 21. So yeah, we need eight badges. We'll get, um, we'll get, um, yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good. We'll be good with that. I spent too much time on that category, man. I, I feel like I'm just talking in circles. But you, you understand what I'm saying. I hope y'all do. <laughs> but let's get into the best part of the build, man, the three-point shooting. We do have a 93 three-point shot on this build, and we have an 80 mid-range shot along with a 70 free throw. And as you guys can see, we do get 26 of them things, man. You know what I'm talking about? And I may did my math wrong on the other one, but I don't care nothing about that, man. Come on now. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, yeah, man, we're going to make it work, man. We're going to make it do what it do. You feel me? So with those 26 badges, now... This is the example I was trying to give you guys. Like, when you have a low three-point shot, it's okay to have a low amount of shooting badges. But when you got a high three-point shot, that unlocked a lot of other stuff. So, yes, we got 26, okay, because we need it, right? So, we'll use limitless range on this bill. I probably would use age three on this bill, you know, because I would start fading and pulling up and all that stuff with a bill like this if I had the 93 three-point shot. I'm just saying. Okay, I use catch and shoot, of course, amp, green machine, corner specialist, Play more. I would throw in Meet a Magician, and I would also throw in Guard Up. Those are the badges that I would use on this build. I hate Dead Eye. I hate Blinder. So, hey, hey, judge me on that if you want to. It don't matter to me. I don't like those badges, and that's just what it is. But you may use those badges. I'm not saying don't use them. You know what I'm saying? If you use them, they work for you, then keep using them. But let's go ahead and get it to the south. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button. And let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody named Mama can see this video. And I need everybody and Mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. My controller stay tweaking, man. I need to give me another controller, but, you know, I ain't worried about this still work. So, hey, it is what it is. And I got another one over there. I don't really want to use that, but, hey, man. Speed with ball, we're going to take that up to an 83, okay? Uh, the ball handle is a 92 on this build. No, I'm not going to a 90, but this time I decided to go ahead and go to a 92. Um... I don't have a build with a 92 ball handle. The highest I go on my personal build is a 90, but a 92 does unlock more dribble moves for you guys that like to do all the dribbling. For the pass accuracy, we do have an 86, and that will allow us to get 25 total badges when it comes to the playmaking. 
which I think you need that. You probably need a lot more, but um, you know, it's a way you can set this stuff up, right? So when I create my own bills, um, I don't necessarily just panic when I think I don't have enough badges, you know, because 2K put those uh, patterns out that you can core two badges in one category. That really can take your bill to another level, okay? With a bill like this, you focus on shooting and you focus on playmaking, right? So you could take the the, the uh, rebirth badges and add them to the shooting or the playmaking, and then you could just core two badges in one category in the other one. So that will help you out, and you won't need as many badges as you think you do because a lot of people don't pay attention to that stuff, and a lot of people didn't hit level 40 that season, so they wouldn't know about it anyway. But with those 25, I would go Anchor Breaker, Need a Threader, Dimer, Quick First Step, a Light Vice Grip, add that. Unpluggable, Hyperdrive, Clamp Breaker, Handle for Days, and Mismatch Expert does work too if you want to use that. And I don't use Bell Out either, so hey man, judge me if you want to. I'm fine with that. But let's go ahead and get it to the defense, right? This build is a two-way play shot. Not saying uh, Steph Curry is a lockdown in real life, but we do have some defense on this build. And I hate to see people sacrifice their defense just to get some offense. Like, put the defense on the build, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, defense is what's going to make you uh, different from everybody else, okay? Those little small build running around with no defense, man, they get punished in the wreck, man. You feel me? For the perimeter defense, we're going to take that to an 86. That will allow us to get that um, silver clamps, as you guys can see. Very important badge. For the steel, we're going to take that to an 86, and that will give us the two-way play shot name. I didn't want the name Playmaker Shot Creator, so I hope you guys can understand why I did what I did. Um, 86 and 86, that's pretty good, man. You get silver clamps, silver intercept, silver glove, you will be able to get some stops on the perimeter. For the block, we're going to take that up to a 60. Um, we have a 32 on the um, interior defense. And a 41 on the rebound, in which we're not worried about that. And we still get 21 bad, so that's pretty good. I will go with Clamps, Intercept the Glove. Uh, we'll throw in Menace with this build, Chase Down, and Pogo. Not bad. So look at the combination. 13, 26, 25, and 21. You know why you're out there. It's not a secret. You're a great playmaking build, and that's what you need to be out there doing. Now, a lot of people may disagree with this part, but I like to go 9 Acceleration, 75 um, um, Speed. 36 Strength, 45 uh, Vert. And the rest is on stamina. Now, I had a 99 stamina on this build now. Or you can do it like this. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I thought we can uh, we can get one more on the speed or something. Nah, we can't. So, um, we're going to put that. Let's try to put that up then. That's 98. So, we're trying to get that 99. Let's go ahead and do the 99 stamina. God, dog. Man, y'all be talking about my stamina, man. We got 99. I know somebody going to come in the comments and say that's too much, but it is what it is. But let's get into the takeover. So we have defense, we got playmaker, we got sharpshooting, we got shot credit. Not bad. We're just gonna choose something for the video. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we do have shades of Mark Price, Fred Van Vliet, and we got Steph Curry right there. And the build name is a two-way play shot. That's the build I'm out of here, man. Charge.